Hi guys, today I'm here to talk about the new Revlon Color Stay Wit, which is this product right here that I'm holding. Um, when I first heard of it, I'm like, oh, I have to go get it, I have to go get it because I've been, I've been hearing so many good reviews about this product that I had to run to the pharmacy and get it. Um, my color is 330 in, uh, what is it, true beige. I don't know if you guys can focus, but anyway, um, it says here on top of the cap 24 hours and um, who wants to stay 24 hours with the makeup on? I do like six hours or when I go out at night or all day long, but when I get home around five, six o'clock, I wash my face. But um, let me show you how it looks like. First, it comes in a bottle like this and it's glass. Be careful not to drop it on the floor. You open a cap and it comes like this. And you take this off. And it feels really weird. The thing is that people think it's a mousse. It's not a mousse. It's a whipped. It, I don't know, it's very cr creamy and thick, as you can see. Um, and I'm going to put it on my hands. And you can see it's going to blend really well. Um, it blends really well, right? Um, the only thing that is not good for some people is that you cannot apply it with a blending brush or a kabuki brush. You have to apply it with your fingers, which I have no problem with that. I love applying foundation with my hands because the product um, warms on my fingers and it's easy for me for me to blend it on my face I use the blending brush of course I use the foundation brush yes I use the kabuki right after I apply it I use the kabuki to um, smooth it out but um, but besides that this is a very good product I'm in love with this I bought it for $14 at CVS and I don't know what about Walgreens or any other pharmacy that you have near your house. Um, I've heard people that paid $16 on this and I heard people that paid $15, $99, I paid my $14. So um, yeah, I'm using it right now. Uh, what I did is I applied my Revlon Color Stay Whipped on my face with my fingers and I just um, used the kabuki to blend it and accentuate on my skin and then I did not use a powder at all all I did was I used um, Bahama Mama to make my contour and I used my MAC blush a little bit on top which is the peach twist that's all I did and then I applied my red lipstick which I love and my um, eyeliner I am not wearing eyeshadow or anything else that's all I'm using and and my um, mascara that's all I'm using um, I just wanted to tell you guys that I'm so in love with this product and this is really really good and um, you should go to your nearest pharmacy and get it and try it on. You can leave a post on the bottom here. And if you like this video, which is my very first review video, give me a thumb up. And yeah, that's basically it. At the end of this um, video, I'm going to demo um, how I applied this on my skin. So you have an idea how it changes and how my face looks like before and after okay and 
like I said, if you like this video, please press down below, thumb up, and um, leave your comments, or if you want to leave a response video, um, feel free to do it, and leave your comments, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, my channel is like Portuguese and English. Um, I wanted to apologize first for the lighting on the other videos that you guys have been watching, which is not good. Um, I have a very yellow light right in front of me where I used to film, and my face looks like yellow and brown. It doesn't really give me that um, regular, my skin, regu my regular skin color. So I really wanted to apologize, and I'm working on the lighting so I can make good videos, and also. Um, I wanted to tell you guys that I'm going to start doing English videos with a caption on the bottom in Portuguese and Portuguese videos with a caption in English on the bottom. I feel more comfortable um, doing videos in English uh, because I live in the States and I feel more comfortable talking in English because the products I read are in English and I every day is my English speaking so I'm really not comfortable um, using the words for the eyes or you know for things in Portuguese but I'm going to try actually I am trying um, but I have not done any caption vice versa like English video caption Portuguese or video in Portuguese caption in English I'm going to try to do that and see if it works okay um, thumbs up for me if you like it and I'll see you in the next video stay tuned for the demo bye bye